Welcome to another episode of ATS Podcast. My name is Jay. E, your boy. You already know. Yes, sir. And you know what you're here for. We're here to give you a deeper introspective into what all things being spiritual means. So you know what it is and you know what time it is. Take your shoes off. Standing Those on bastards. holy ground. Yes, mm. sir. How you doing, my G? Take it, dog. Another one. Yes, sir. Even if it's the hard way, still the God way, right? Up in it, dog. We up in it, dog. Playoff Come on, start. Man. Mm. Come on, man. Playoff time. <laughs> hey, perennial, perennial playoff players. <laughs> Got to up it, dog. Now the level, mm. now the what? Mm. Mm. Not the Panamera. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, come on, man. Come on, man. Playoff yes, start, sir. dog. Up it. Got to up the game. Got to up the game, dog. Playoffs time, you know. So, so we are. That's what we on, man. But um, you know, we we'll just jump right in and, and break this bread, man. You yes, know, you sir. That's what we love for. this one. Mm, it's a doozy. It's a doozy. <laughs> hey, man. Yeah. We're just gonna label this one. Pass on the baton. Mm, get off. <laughs> yes, sir. It's a doozy, dog. Pass on the baton, dog. Come on, man. Old, that old principle, man. It's just I remember old, that talk. And that that principle is old as dirt. Mm, yes, sir. And, um, Foundational heights. It's the most simplest place we just. We were at, you know, chalk, chalk that one up to CC on my way back. Yes, sir. The last little place we were at, and, you know, mm -hmm. she just looked over to me, and she's like, he's not cut from that cloth. He doesn't pass on the baton. I'm like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's man. He's yep. not cut from that cloth. He doesn't pass on the baton. Mm. He's not cut from that cloth. No. Hey, hey. I said, say no more, Lord. Look how far that word has went. Mm. I heard a man come on and says, hey, man, they were it take them seven years to get 48. Mm. Get off us. Yes, Look sir. All that word went. Yes, took sir. them seven years to just get 48. Mm. You feel me? Yes, sir. I have an appreciation for such things. Come on, man. Took Israel 40 years just to go round and round. <laughs> oh, man. So. Yes, sir. Yeah, man. Pass on a baton. Um, going to break bread with you. Make you understand these jewels and these principles, these parables that we speak, mm. that you just hear, but you know, you don't relate. Yep. In the genesis of scripture, you have a lot of promises and a lot of prophecies. Just in the genesis of scripture alone, there's a lot of prophecies and there's lots of what? Promises. We see God made man. And just in that alone, you see a prophecy. The prophecy of the posterity. Yeah. And you shall bear a child. He shall bruise the head. He shall bruise the heel. Heel. Yes, sir. And that's heavy. And then we go on. And we see various promises. Biggest one we'll call out to you. You all know about rainbow and all that stuff. Now, yeah, uh, yeah. let's get try to yeah. give you an order. Now, uh, the rainbow the promise that uh, that was a promise. Yeah. That I'm really Never. trying to focus on that boy Abraham. Yes, sir. And the promise was given on to him. <clears throat> but in that promise, and we're tying in the promise and the prophecy. Mm. Appreciate these things, can you? Uh. Come on, man. Mm. Way before Abraham, a word was spoken to those people. Yes, sir. Adam. And that he shall bruise the head, he shall bruise the heel. heel. Yep. That word coincides and ties in. With Abraham promise, prophecy, promise, they tied it, intertwined, <sighs> break the seal off this one, interwoven into the fabric, not disturbing texture. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do with them, homie, you can't do with them. What are you going to do with them? <laughs> <laughs> Only but goody. We call that breaking the seal. Yes, sir. We're keeping it moving.
And in a prophecy, there is always a fulfillment of what? Time. Yes, sir. As well as in a promise. Yes, sir. But what happened? Time said, the time fulfilled. Occupy on till. till. Yes, sir. Appreciate these jewels. So even though said to Adam, we see one carrying on the posterity, Noah. Mm -hmm. Then we see Abraham. Abraham begot Isaac. Isaac begot Jacob. Now, this is just a small little thing. You got to over there. So you got pastors. And you know the Adam thing and Isaac and Esau. The God came and definitely said, and true, Isaac is the promise. So make no quabs about that. Isaac is true to, is true to whom what? The promise of what God gave him is coming through. Not Abraham, Esau, Esau, yeah, Esau, yeah, yeah, right. So, God just wanted to clarify that why is that important? Understanding the culture of firstborn, yeah, yeah, but we're back to what seeds of the spirit, seeds of the flesh. flesh. That's why you have pastors. <laughs> 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 We're not coming off it. Yeah, keep it yeah. moving. Time keep it on the next. Yeah. Time is yep. of the essence. Yep. Abraham, Isaac, Isaac begot Jacob. Jacob, Joseph, the twelve, and Joseph. And um, the skeptics shall not depart from Judah. Yeah. This one is called passing on what? The baton. Yes, sir. Noah received the baton from what? Lamech. And Lamech received it from Methuselah and bam, 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 bam. You can catch all those jewels in the Genesis. Yeah. Noah begot Isaac, Isaac begot Jacob. That's passing on what? The baton. Yep. Okay. What baton are you talking about? Baton of promise and baton of what? Prophecy. Yep. We're not going to make this too over spiritual because we are going to show you something what? Earthly. So you can understand it what? Heavenly. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bastards. You're not worthy. Mm. You have a relay. A man is running. If everybody passed the baton in, in, in what? In the restricted area around mm -hmm. the track and stay in their lane, it's yeah. a legal race and the first man oh, and the first team over the line win. win. Yep. But we've all seen relays. And sometimes a baton is passed, what? Outside the box. Yeah. Then what happened? You become disqualified. Yeah. Also, the baton can what? Be dropped. Dropped, yep. And then you can still pick up the baton or try, but you already know you can't. It's going to penalize you. It's going to hurt you. Especially in the sprint. It's a wrap. Yeah. It's a, it's a wrap. Yeah. It's done. So we see these things. So we're showing you something earthly so you can see it spiritually. This one is called passing on the baton. What you read is scripturally is people passing on the baton in a spiritual manner, carrying on the posterity until the fulfillment of the, full, the fullness of time, both prophecy and promise. But we want to also make you understand that this is a principle of spirit. Mm. And this same principle can be brought to any level of life. Any level of what? Life. We're at um, Joseph. And Joseph carried on the posterity and brought them into Egypt. A generation came that didn't know the full, um, the prom, the, the talk that was given to um, Adam, not Adam, Abraham, about 400 years, is now come to pass. They're into, mm -hmm. that they're into that liberty. And we had Moses now call up. 
Moses' time to run. Yeah. Moses passed on the baton to? Joseph, Joshua. Joshua. His time's up. Joshua then brought them. Um, it was a sidekick to Moses while in the wilderness. And he got the baton and he carried them and he, he set them up into what? The promised land. Yeah. Did his, did his thing, did run his race mm -hmm. and his leg and it was called. And when they got there, there was a whole bunch of war. They got to fight and all that. So he passes the four. You know, it's all in there in Joshua. Knock yourselves yes, out. The same yes, Bible sir. study. <laughs> Principal talk. The same Bible study, though. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Wait. So after that, they called upon, you know, they get red eye. One of the kings like the other nations. So various yeah. kings came. Yeah. And kings pass on baton to kings and judges and all that stuff. In that period of time, God has always have, God has never, God is, a, this is the principle of scriptures. God has never left his, himself, himself without what? God has never left himself without a posterity yes, in the land. Yes, sir. And what the prophet says, oh Lord, no, I'm the only one that's left. And God says, I have 7,000 more than about to need yep. to ball, yep. fall back. Yep. He, he's never left himself without a posterity in the land, in the mm -hmm. earth, yep. no matter how things look. Yeah. Never. That's a principle of scripture. We, we, we go to Elisha now. Sometimes it looks as if you are in the, the, um, the minimum and the lesser than, whatever term you want to use. Yes, sir. Elisha says, open up his eyes to the little yep. man. So you can see. A little sidekick. Yep. It's so much of them and so few of us. Mm -hmm. Open up his eyes, Lord. Yep. Open up his eyes. Because he was seeing in veiled eyes. Open up his eyes for that moment in time and show him. And like, whoa. Now, if you understand these scriptures, tie that back in now with when Christ was there. And Christ says, if this was my kingdom, mm -hmm. I would have called a legion off and they'd have come to my aid. But only if this was my yeah. kingdom. Yes, sir. We'll be better to you on that one. You can catch up on that one. That's why you had the pastors for. A ATS. Yeah. We're just dealing with this one is just called passing on the baton. Yes, sir. Prophets after prophets came. Every prophet did their dispensation. There's no carryover and loop over. There's no yeah. four prophets in one corner, four church in one corner. Spirit <laughs> of God doesn't work like that. It's confusion. Yeah. A prophet come to this dispensation. Elijah came. Elijah did his time. Yep. Put the cloak on and the anointing unto Elisha. It wasn't them on the scene together. Prophet came, prophet go, so on and so on. Not no overlapping. It's a principle of scripture. God is not a God of confusion. So different prophets came, did their time, so on, so on, and so on. What are we seeing here? We're seeing a passing off the baton in posterity until the time to fulfill the promise until the promise and we see prophecy the prophecy is given too now yeah. the definition of prophecy is also in scripture a definition of prophecy is in scripture right and in that prophecy of scripture it tells you what a definition of prophecy is don't quote me on that, but it might be in the book of Kings. Okay. And it says, this is what a true prophecy is. You know, mm -hmm. God says so until in prophecies, prophecy given by God is not up to man. Prophecy given, God says his prophecies and God is the same one who fulfill his Fills. prophecies. Yes, sir. Yes. Understand that principle of scripture. It is God who say and God who fulfill it. Yes, sir. A true prophecy. Okay. So we're moving on, and um, we have to talk about that, boy. Um, yeah, it's important to understand um, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, and um, in that last part when Jacob given his, his blessings over the kids, mm -hmm. and, and the skeptic shall not depart from Judah. Yeah, yeah. You're right, the ruler shall not depart from Judah. So now through the lineage of Judah is coming that, what? It's coming the tree, yep. 15 or 16 from Genesis that you read mm -hmm. in that prophecy, yeah. okay? Again, interwoven into the fabric, not disturbing the texture, 
And the same word, different time, but a word was also given unto who? Abraham. Yes, sir. Okay? That, that same prophecy is tied into Abraham. Don't mm. get that confused. Okay. And so, we know it's coming through the lineage, the line of Judah. And you know the... You know, you know, the, um, the lineage there is, is spelled out in Matthew and all that stuff. Yeah. This one is called Passing on the Baton. And before there was people before David, and David begot such and such, and such and such begot David, and the whole lineage is there for you. So I have pastors. <laughs> we have come up now, and um, in these various prophecies, various books, um, things, of th things are spoken to and, and, and spoken of. That's called first principle. First principle is very important. First principle is a thing where the first time it was said, then you know, it's a principle going forth. First principle. So when you hear we said, um, and before there was any, God gave his own amen. That's first principle. Mm -hmm. Before anything was going on, you read it and God said it was good, praising himself. But yet still when you read in scriptures, it says everything had to be witnessed by two or three. Self-praise is no recommendation, but he's the exception. First yeah. principle of scripture. Yeah. And so on forth. So we're keeping it moving. And um, throughout scriptures, various prophets, various things, Prophecies were given onto things um, just off the top of my head, like like a like a Psalms, like Psalms twenty two. Was it da was it David? Was David speaking about himself? Clearly, when you read that, you cross reference it to see he was, you know, David didn't die in that manner or whatever, or suffered in that manner. You know, it's talking about a crucifixion and piercing side and all kind of stuff. It's literally, you know, and yeah. so now um, Elijah, Elijah fifty three. Is Elijah talking about himself? Is uh, is is um, which Mitchka was he born in Bethlehem? So on and so on, right throughout mm -hmm. Scripture. Now you can understand what Peter was talking about when we read First Peter, um, chapter one. You, you can get the full context of it between chapter verse ten and twelve, but ex specifically eleven and twelve. Yeah. Chapter one, verse eleven and twelve, and it says, "Men speaking of." The Christ within them, the Christ mm -hmm. mean anointing, the anointing within them of which time he was to come. Yeah. So David, because he was anointed, although when he's writing those Psalms, it was the anointed speak, break seal on them again, because we taught these things, but they don't understand. Few men speaking what? Hear Hear themselves. themselves. Yes, sir. Costing nothing. These are jewels, bastard. Jewels. <laughs> jewels upon jewels. <laughs> Heights. Yes, sir. Do you appreciate these things? Mm. Few men speak and hear themselves. So the, the, the Christ within them yep. was speaking yep. of what time he was to come. Um, yep. Men realizing they're not serving themselves, but serving others. Yes, sir. Things to which angels long to look into. Mm. Preach. Ah, bastards. <laughs> mm. Keeping it moving, passing on the baton. We're up to Malachi. Them boys come. The fulfillment is here. He's here. Mm -hmm. And Isaiah says, And a virgin shall be born with a child. His name shall be called Emmanuel, God with us. He's yes, here. Sir. Yes, sir. He's here. On the scene, incarnate, manifested word. All that talk from the Genesis of 3, 15, and 16, bruise head. Yeah. The bruise head, he should bruise your heel. Heel, yep. The fulfillment of that, Judas, yep. he who sheet of my bread lifted up his heel. heel. At me. Uh, it homework. cost you nothing. It cost you nothing. 
Okay. We're keeping it moving. We just what? Passing on the, the baton. baton. We, what, what are we doing? Passing on the, on the baton. So all these jewels that you're getting, remember, we're in the race. Yeah. In case we you forget. have the baton. Yep. But what good is it if I don't pass, pass on the on. baton? Can we talk grill? <laughs> <laughs> what good is it if I don't pass on the baton? Yep. How yep. can you have jewels and don't pass it on? Yep. How can you have information for one less than you who's just coming in and you don't pass it on? Mm. What does that say for your character and of you as a person? Come on, what man. What did it say? Oh, leave, leave them to figure it out themselves. So stingy. Did God leave it out for you to figure it out yourselves? Never. That's why you send prophets. That's why you send this one. That's why you send that one. He didn't yep. Imagine if God had to let them figure it out himself. Mm. It's a principle of scripture. It's a way of life. It's a way of being. Yep. Every actual creature teach the young one. You see it in, you see it in creation. You see it in nature. Mm -hmm. So when you as a reasoning man don't pass on the baton. Doing the injustice. You are lesser than an ant. Yep. Because even the ant teach the new ant and every, everything teaches the new one. Yep. Pass on the baton. Come on, man. Yeah, preach. Mm. Huge. Keeping it moving. Manifested it. The, the incarnate is here. Manuel is doing his thing. Thomas Fleeting. Fleeting. Mm. Fleeting. Thomas Fleeting. Bastards like me live to see more wire and ours than him. Mm. Mm -hmm. Preach. 33 years is all he had. Mm. I can give you a whole synopsis of that and why that is and how it is, but that's why you got pastors. Mm. <laughs> I'll give you a small little nugget. You can take it and run with it. Read Leviticus and read what it says when you have a boy child, when a woman have a boy child and read those jewels. Cost you nothing, and for 33 days she should be unclean. Ah! <laughs> Cost you nothing. Just that's just a jewel. Yeah, yeah. Jewel. For 33 days she should be unclean, and so happened. Ah, but you didn't know when he was talking how he was talking. He didn't understand spiritual thing. A day's like a thousand years. A thousand years like a day. Day. Ah, uh, day in off. prophecies a year. Ah, a day in prophecies a year. Mm. Mm. You bastards! It cost you nothing. But we're gonna keep on moving. This is called Pass, Pass on, on the, the baton. baton. Keep it moving. We're not dealing with the low fries here. We're not, we, this is the big dog stuff. So every example have to be about a pinnacle. He's here. <laughs> pinnacle is here. <laughs> Come on, man. It costs you nothing. <laughs> the pinnacle is here. The pinnacle is here. Oh, man. Now, you'll appreciate this. <laughs> dog, you sitting down, homie? Nah. <laughs> Make sure. Nah. You're going to get crazy for this one. Make sure. Dog, the pinnacle is coming. He's leaving. Look, how, look at Grace. Look how gracious the pinnacle is. He says, well, first and foremost, understand things like when you read Genesis 6. In Genesis, ah, come on. Come on. They're not worried, but we're still going to break bread with them. In Genesis 6, it says, my spirit not, will not strive with man forever. Yes, sir. Quote, quote. And he said, I'm going to break better than for 120 years. Mm. My spirit mm. will not strive with men forever. This is pre-nowadays. Pre-now. Yep. yep. Pre-now. Pre-now. Yes, yes, sir. My spirit will not strive with... Because before that, you mm -hmm. read some big numbers. 970. Yes, 970. Yes, sir. Man, Crazy you, grace. Everybody's <laughs> touching a G. Everybody's yeah. up on a G. Yep. Maybe? Crazy. Yep. Man, man living to close to a thousand. And we're like, whoa, yeah. some big numbers. Heavy. Hey, man ain't having their first kid till they're 500 years old. Yes. Yes. Heavy. Heavy. And so all of a sudden, we just see it talking. Spirit of the Lord says, ah, they're moving a certain way. Yep. God, some men are wicked. We ain't going to strive them forever, you know. 
confusing. Spot them, spot, yo, spot them 120, spot them 120. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three now, three now. Mm hmm. After Noah, there's another talking prophecy. And it says, if you strength, man shall see 70 years. If you strength, Psalms. Yeah, yeah. Psalms, yeah, Psalms. Yeah, yeah. Pre, three, dumb, it's a pre Noah. Yeah. What after Noah? Three scores. Yeah. Three scores. At 70 years, you bastards. Yeah. yeah, do your homework. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 70. This is another principle of scriptures for those who think that the Spirit of God moved chronologically. Mm. Line up a line, please, from precept, a little here and a little there. <laughs> Get that into you. <laughs> Get all of us. Yeah. Get that into you. Yep. Yep. And while yep. they were still speaking, the Spirit of the Lord answered, mm. Isaiah, cost you nothing. Mm. Yep. Anyways, we're keeping it moving. Yes, yeah, sir. The graciousness of the incarnate leaving, leaving. On his way out. Did he not say it's a finish the line and it's done? Yep. And it is done. It is done. But now I am going to go into grace, 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 you bastards, grace. Mm. And what is the Lord says? And though I'm leaving, I'm I going to leave you a comforter. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, Come on, grace, man. Preach, yes, grace. Preach. Preach. Still passing on the baton even when the race is over. No. Oh. Let me ask you a second. Still passing on the baton even when the race is over. Yes. Don't miss that jewel. Come if you get man. nothing else, get that Grace. jewel. Yep. Still passing on the baton, even though the race, though is, the race over. is over. Come on, man. It is done. And he's yep. still passing on the baton. And says, That's I'm what you call I'm Grace. Gonna receive you with a comforter. Yep. Passing That's on the, the baton. That's the definition of grace. Passing on the baton. Yep. Yep. It's so, over. For a man not to pass on the baton to his seed to say, yo. This is how you tie your tie. Yep. This is how you carry yourself. This yes, is sir. liberty. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yo, I should have been better off, you know, but I, I, I scattered too much seeds. I this, I that. Anything. Yep. What? It's passing on the baton. Anything yes, you sir. before showed up, you pass it on to the next man to say, hey, if I'd done this or done this in my lifetime, I could have been. If you're not doing that and holding juice to yourself and down with it and down with it. He was on the cross and he's still telling them, giving them grace. He says, I'm going to send a comforter. Drop. And it's over. And he's mm -hmm. still sending grace. Didn't cheat. Didn't cheat us one bit, man. Come mm. on, man. Mm. Pass Every on second. Time. Pass Come on, on man. It's a Preach. principle of scripture. It's a principle yes, of the Lord. Pass on the baton. Yes, sir. It's a principle of scripture. Pass on the baton. It's all it is. And yeah. So we can keep these jewels. We can sit on these jewels. But for what? We only get the jewels to pass it on. We yeah. only get the jewels to pass it on. Yep. We don't get it to keep it. It's nope. just to pass it on. Rivers, not reservoirs. Profits are nothing if you hold it. Profits are nothing. Man. Come they, on. Hey, hey. No interest on this. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> no interest. Ain't no, interest. no interest on yep. it. Yep. No compounded interest, no nothing. This mm -hmm. Yeah, freely Perfect. you receive, freely, freely you, give. you give. Yep. Pass on jewels. You get an illumination, pass it on. Pass it on. You get a revelation, pass, pass it, on. it on. Got yep. a principle, pass it on. Mm. And yours is for the body of Christ. It's for the kingdom. Yep. Ain't for me, ain't for you. Pass it on. Um, yep. Pass on the baton. So Huge. we just need everyday life, even though we're passing on spiritual principles, spiritual jewels, and we what? Went to the highest order of showing you what passing on the baton is. And the, the definition of passing on the baton, God himself passing on a baton. Yep. What baton that is? Hey, I always was my intention for you to live forever. Mm -hmm. An Get extension off me. of grace. Yes, sir. Always my intention for you to live yep. forever. Pass yep. on the baton. Even though, go. hey, even though them boy dropped the button in the first round. Yes, sir. <laughs> Not getting off your neck. <laughs> on the first leg, the boy dropped the baton. The first, yep. yo. The first. The boy wasn't even out of the starting blocks and, and oh, back to drop. Yep. It was real quick. 
It was over quick. Hear me? And the Lord says, it was always my intention. For you to live forever. So he mm. did what he did to what? Manifestations of time. You understand? Dispensations. Yep. Just to get it right. Mm. Pass on the baton. Yes, sir. Hey, now, there's one man carrying the baton to what? Pass on to another man. Now, you got to be a willing recipient to, to receive the baton. Yes, yeah, sir. If your hand ain't out, you ain't going to catch it. <laughs> Add it to you. Yep. You have to be a, res a willing yes. recipient to receive yes. the baton. Yes. What about the man passing on the baton? We see a lot of problems with this. It's the principle of scripture. When Abraham passed on about the baton, what happened? To out of here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> when Isaac, hold on, yeah, I got you. Yeah, hold, yeah, on, yeah. hold on, hold on, <laughs> hold on, hold on. When Isaac Get passed on the baton, what happened? Yep. Out of here. here. What yep. happened when Jacob passed on the baton? Out of here. here. Yep. What happened when Moses passed on the baton? Out of here. What happened when the Christ passed on the baton? Out of here. Yep. And the Holy Spirit, I shall send you a comforter. So we see this thing within man's spirit. Mm -hmm. And a man feel that if I keep, the, the longer I keep the baton, the longer, the longer I'm here. I'll be here. <laughs> the longer I keep the baton, the longer I'm here. <laughs> yep. When the work is done, the job is done. Get out of here. Yep. Well, what did we say? If that baton is not passed within the what? The restricted box. Yes, it's illegal. You're disqualified. Yes. So everybody's disqualified. Something. I gotta show you something <laughs> earthly yes. so you can yes. see that. <laughs> so you can hold on the baton all ever you all long if you want it. Mm -hmm. But if you give me the baton and give me outside the box. Yep. We're disqualified now. Yes, sir. You mess up the whole chain. Mm -hmm. You're no longer running on a winning team. Yeah. Thank God your bot name coming from Safra. Mm, get off me. <laughs> Thank God we glorified. Thank God my bot name coming from Papa Dukes. Yes, sir. Come on, man. Because I've seen men who hold yep. the baton too long. Too long. <laughs> yes, yeah, sir. I don't need your amens. I, I, don't said, need I your said it amens. was good all by myself. Amens, man. So good. <laughs> I don't need your amens, man. So, God didn't even leave it up to man to pass on the baton because he saw the wickedness in their heart. Ungrateful at a call. No. If you're waiting on the baton from some man, you're going to be disqualified. Come on, man. Yo. Even on their deathbed, they're holding on to it. Dog, I heard if you're looking for mercy, don't look at men. Don't if look at men. Grave. Come on, dog. <laughs> what they bury say, me. bury me with it. Bury me with it. <laughs> yo, yo, he, he come in his lifetime and make some papers. Yep. He don't even pass on that jewel to his seed. Come on, man. Yo, imagine there's some simple things, earthly things. You know what you just said? <laughs> he don't even pass it on to his seed, right? Hey, 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 hey. No. He passed the money on, but don't tell him how to make that money. Come on, man. You cheated him. You cheated him. You thought you did him you did it, you thought he you did him justice? You cheated him. Come on, man. It's not enough. Oh. It's not enough. Few men speaking here themselves. Few men speaking here themselves. There'll be no appreciation for this for a while. Come on, come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> That's on the baton. Come on, man. Okay. It's okay. We do this for the Lord. Mm. Save your, keep your amens. Keep your amens, yep. Listen, the Lord didn't even leave it up to them to pass on the baton. Yes, sir. Because when he looked at man hard, he saw the wickedness. No. And he says, if I leave it up to them, you know what's yep. going to die? You know what's going to be disqualified? You know what's going to be disqualified? Some of them rather die with the baton in their hand than pass it on. Come on, man. Now, 
caveat time, caveat time. Winding up, time's up the essence. You're not the anchor. Come on, man. You're not running the anchor leg. Go Come easy. Mm -hmm. You're not running the anchor leg. You bastard. You got the baton from somebody. You got yep. the baton from somebody. Yep. No, no, I'm a self-made man. <laughs> God damn it. Hey, man, you can't do with these bastards. <laughs> You're a self-made man? Self-made. Mm. Self-betrayed. <laughs> <laughs> you insignificant vapor. <laughs> you were in the loins of somebody. You were in the loins of somebody. Spat out. Just like how you move on, somebody came out of your loins, you were in the loins of somebody. Yep. Even if that man never gave you grace, a grain of rice, you don't even understand. Yep. Talk real. Talk real to them. I hold it. Talk, Talk real. real. Talk real, Doc. We're here. <laughs> Appreciate the bastard, even if I call him a bastard, he didn't catch mm. you in a condom. Appreciate the bastard, even mm. though he, he, he could have dropped you on the stomach. Appreciate mm. the bastard, he could have squatted you in the face. Appreciate mm. the bastard, he could have caught you in a towel. Appreciate the bastard. Appreciate the bastard. <laughs> they gonna do with them, dog. <laughs> they gonna do with them, dog. We ain't gonna, Dude, we're Dude, not even gonna talk. We're not even gonna talk about those who got swallowed. Oh. oh. <laughs> talk real. <laughs> can't speak about God and don't speak truth. I, that's all I say. Can't talk truth and don't speak about God. That's all we say. <laughs> so you don't even have an appreciation for that man. Call him mm -hmm. a bastard. All you want to call him a bastard. All you want. If that all boy you caught want. you a condom, you wouldn't have so much talk. Ah! Mm. Get off me. If that boy caught mm. you a condom, you wouldn't have so much talk. Can't talk back, could you? Mm. Mm. Wow. Show some appreciation. Heavy. Heavy. And yet Jesus Christ heavy. came and paid homage to who? John the Baptist. John the Baptist. Pay homage yes, to sir. those who paved the way. Mm. It's this principle of scripture. Spirit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. We're just talking about passing on the baton today. Yep. Yep. Cost you nothing. Mm. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. If we stop now, it's no shame. If we go on, it's just more glory. Glory. Oh, man. It cost call it nothing. Call him over it spiritual. Nothing. It cost him nothing. <laughs> this one's all passing on the baton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was... Go easy. Easy. Every man acting like they want in the anchor. Go easy. Let go easy. of the baton. Yep. Give it to the young buck. Let go of the baton. Feel me? You might be running the starting leg. I hear some, mm -hmm. I hear a new talk now from these new people. What are you they know? talking about? And they're like, I was born in poverty, but I'm the start of wealth to my fat generation. <laughs> okay, okay, but you're still starting. Mm -hmm. And those, and now that you, you think you're wealthy and you're gonna yep. pass on wealth, you, you might be the start of it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Appreciate your leg. Okay, okay. It's just a leg you're running, so you're yep. the start of that. Yes. In your lineage, okay? Somebody got him on the anchor. Somebody mm. got somebody got him on the back stretch. Somebody got him on the corner. Yeah. But in all of the race, it's only one anchor. In all yeah. of the race, there's one anchor. It's one anchor for everybody. It's yes, done. Sir. You ever yeah. heard? It's done. Finish. Finish. He is the anchor. He is the anchor of all the relays and all the races. Mm -hmm. So easy. Everybody mm. acting like they're running the anchor leg. Pass on the baton. Yeah. Mm. There's a reason why the Lord said 40 years service in scripture. There's a reason why he has a cut off in ministry. Read Leviticus. Some of these bastards don't want to pass on the baton. Yes, sir. Preach. We won't even get into that. It's for your yeah, pastors. Yeah, yeah, Everybody yeah, can yeah. read that. Yeah, they have yeah. a time limit. Come out of ministry at this time and so on. They just keep going and going. Oh. And Yo, this ain't daytime TV. We just keep renewing contracts. Pass on the baton. Mm. Yep. Pass on the baton. You got that lifelong judge seat, huh? That Congress, hey, man. congressional seats, huh? Think this is think this is some high high court thing that they rig. Come on, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All they kind of people let it up go. there, rapists and all kind of people. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, man. You know we're hitting it where it hurts. That's facts. That's facts.
Pass on the baton is what this one is called. Come on, man. The jewels you get, you don't appreciate it. It's okay. Yep. Principles, you know, and all those things. It's okay. Yep. Keep Huge. you safe, your amens. Heights. Yeah, man. Anything, anything I didn't touch on that cross your mind, man. We didn't, we didn't, we didn't touch it, man. Man. <laughs> you know how it is, man. Come on, man. Woo. Yeah, drunk off the spirit. Golly. That's on the baton, man. But we want to show them something earthly so they can see yes. spiritually. You know? Yes. And we want to yes. talk to them. We want to talk to mothers. We want to talk to fathers. Yes. We want to talk to brothers. Yes. We want to talk to sisters. Yes. Everybody yes. has something they can pass on. Of course. Pass on the baton, man. Mama teach you to cook. Teach mm. her to cook. Mama teach yes. him to cook. Teach him to pass on the baton, man. Yes, yes, Pass yes, on the baton yes. and be careful in this new world that we're living in with computers and everybody just getting, you know, pass on the baton, man. Pass on the baton. It's yes. a way of life, of beat, of survival for us as human beings. Pass on the baton. It's essential. Uh, yeah, it's essential. I mean, this is essential work. This on, is essential man. work. You know what I mean? People are talking about what they're doing outside of essential. No, this this been essential work. And I think um, this word comes uh, right on time, as always, right after the grill. You know, right after the grill talk. And, 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 like, and the, reason why, the reason why it's important to pass on the baton, um, I was going to say something about that, you know, that uh, we talk about the grill and pass on the baton. Mm -hmm. And um, the work is done. And all this work is done from the foundation of town. Yes. Right? So all you're talking about is things that God has done and, 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 and passing on that. But we wanted to show you that even though it's a spiritual principle, how to pass it on, you know? Yeah. Like, what did you do in your lifetime that you deemed that benefited you? Mm -hmm. don't, don't look at you. Don't look at somebody that says, let them figure it out. Pass it on. You're leaving the earth. You're, you're going. What are you yep. leaving? Pass it on. Pass yep. on something. Yep. Pass on something, though. Something. Yeah, yeah I mean, you, you, you hit it on the head. I mean, when we, we spoke of the pinnacle, we spoke it of, of the blueprint and show you how God passed it on to us. So just the many layers, the many manifold of God just showing you. Yo, you don't have to look so far off, as you were saying. You know, a yeah. lot of people look like my grand aunt. No, no, no. What did what happened to you? How did mm. you get where you're at right now? What, what what struggles did you go through? What, you know, something? What pitfalls that you telling me I might avoid having? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. the the pass it on the baton, dog, is so huge. This doesn't skip any household. This no, is on, in man. everybody's house. You know what I'm saying? And, and so it's so essential. And and it's a heavy word, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Because if you and if you being stingy, be careful what you pass on. Be careful what you pass on. Mm. Yes, sir. Hey, hey. Me and my you cool. Me and my you grow together. Me and my you to best friends. Me and my daughters are best friends. Yep. Hey, you hear what we passed on? Teach my you to roll weed. Mm. Come on, man. That way you hang your hat on? That way you hang your hat on? That's all mm. you have in your life to pass on? Mm. Really? Really? Ah, who am Not I? looking good. Who am Not I? looking good. There's so much <laughs> more things you can pass on. And look yep. where you're hanging your hat on. Not looking good. You know? And for the females, come on, man. Just st step it up. Step it up. Step it up. Be careful what you pass on. Mm. If one come of age and they going to certain things on their own so be it yep let god hey charge it to grace let god work it out yes sir but that's for you you can do better pass on something essential pass on something of you feel me pass on mm -hmm. some form of liberty yep. pass on something of worth yes you know what i'm saying there's no honor in certain things i mean we don't have to go into it but there's no honor man. in certain things man it's it's even shameful to speak of mm-hmm Feel me? It's even shameful to speak of, you know? So we're not getting into that, you know? So we're just keeping positive and saying, we just want to pass on, you know? Yeah. yeah. Come on, man. I mean, and you see what's going on in this generation, but this generation is a product of the generation before that probably resented the parents for passing on certain things. And I can't believe my parents made me do this. And so what? You don't teach that to your youngin. And now it's just a wayward spirit. So you got wayward spirits breeding more wayward spirits. You know what I'm saying? So the passing of a ton dog is um, so egregious because you're going to have to answer to that. You know what I'm saying? Why didn't you teach? Why didn't you help little Jimmy out? Why, why didn't you teach him about the Lord's way? 
You know what I'm saying? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine if Elijah was stiff necked and says, "I'm passing on the baton to Elisha"? Come on, man. Can you imagine if Moses was stiff necked and says, "I'm down huh. with this now. I'm passing it on to Joshua." Who the hell? Huh. You feel me? Come on. Yep. So on and so on and so on. You feel me? Come mm -hmm. on. We can't even think about it. Yep. So it's the same. It's the same thing. Pass on the baton, man. But yo, man, let's be out with these boys, man. It's a great one. It's a doozy. Yes, sir. Cost yes, them sir. Nothing, we're not gonna. We're not gonna. We're not gonna. Uh, we're not gonna desecrate the message that was. Nah, uh, no, <laughs> I don't want to add nothing to this. You know what? No. Hey, 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 hey! Don't yep, step on yep. this. Stretch it. Don't stretch this one. Come on, don't man. Don't stretch this one. Don't stretch it. Don't stretch this one, man. Just don't call it the gospel. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Don't stretch yes, this. Sir. One. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, man. That was a doozy, you guys. Um, heights upon heights. I can't even recollect because the spirit was going like this. But I know I'm going to appreciate it when I watch it. Um, so you guys keep tuning in. For line the up on the line, precept and precept. A little here and a little there. Nowhere in scripture, the spirit work in. <laughs> Your order. Yeah, nothing. yeah, Constant yeah. Nothing. Get off I can't Get off follow. I can't follow. <laughs> you better follow. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, sir. So, um, hey, man, you know what time it is, and you know what time it was. Take your shoes off. You're standing on holy ground. Holy ground. Filthy animals. Mm, yes, sir. Nothing. Come on, man. All right, my J. Yes, sir. Be great.